Monday's exercise saw over 120 individuals aged 50 and over being screened for glaucoma, diabetic retinopathy, cataracts, and pterygium. Barbuda Affairs Minister, the Honorable Arthur Nibbs, said the eye care initiative was always on the cards for the Barbudan people. It's something that has been in the making. Uh, we had discussions with Comrade Minister Joseph and he assured me that for sure that Barbuda will be included. So this is the reality today and it's a great day for Barbuda and I hope that the people would you know, make use of this um, service because at the end of the day it would be good for all of us. Minister Nibs said he was very impressed with the turnout and believes it will be even greater later in the week. Matron of the Hannah Thomas Hospital, nurse Cynthia Byers, was elated to have the eye care program in her proverbial backyard. And I appreciate the government of Antigua and Barbuda collaborating with the council, Barbuda Council, and the Caribbean Council for the Blind. I'm really grateful for the initiative. Dr. Jeremy Diesel, who specializes in general medicine at the hospital, says the program is going well so far. Things have been looking very good. We've been having some good diagnosis. The patients who have been diagnosed with uh, advanced eye impairment are going to be referred to Antigua. The minor cases are going to be managed here, and we're going to continue to follow up the patients and hope that everybody, you know, fare off well with what we have to offer. Wednesday will feature patients aged 20 to 29, while teenagers will be facilitated on Thursday. Tabulations and consultations have been slated for Friday, the final day of the mission. The Eye Care Mission is an initiative of the Ministry of Health and the Environment in collaboration with the Barbuda Council and the Caribbean Council for the Blind. Sherilyn Beasley reporting for ABS News.